guys, welcome back. So it's Adrian. Today's video is gonna be something a little bit different. I decided to bring in my beautiful sisters with me on camera today. Ma, ma. I got a little lipstick on you, sorry. <laughs> my sister's here on camera today. So today we're gonna be doing the sister tag. So if you wanna learn a little bit about me and my two sisters, please keep watching. All right, so the first question is, well first let's introduce ourselves. This is Andrea, she's my oldest sister. Of course you guys know who I am. I am Adrian. I'm the middle daughter and this is my little sister Alicia. So, the baby. That's the baby, oldest, and I'm the sandwich meat in the middle. <laughs> All right. First question is, how old are we? I'm 33. I am 31 and I am 29. So we're all like almost two years apart. So we, my mama had us very close together. Um, describe each other in one word. I'm gonna go first on this one. I would say Andrea is adventurous because she's a person who would like ride all the rides at the roller coasters. I mean at the roller coasters. On the roller coasters, she would be the one to jump off of a bridge. She'll be the one to skydive. Anything. She yeah has no fear when it comes to that. Yes, she will fight for me. <laughs> Literally, she would do it all. Like that's the one. She's very adventurous. <sighs> Alicia, I would say, very humble. She's very very humble. She is um, the type of person that will give you the shirt off her back. She will stop and give somebody money if they needed it. I'll just say that she's very giving and humble. Ooh. That's actually two words, but humble Sweet. the most part. So that's my two words for them. And we can call Adrian, we'll say one word for her. She's a scary one. <laughs> I am scared. <laughs> Yes, as little girls, she used scared. to always fall underneath me. Everywhere I go, this was my shadow. Adrian, Adrian. Adrian, Adrian. Everywhere. And I was like, oh, get away from me. Now, I mean, like, we're each other's best friends. We're there for each other through the good and the bad. And I will really, try, really and truly count that a blessing. So. Okay, so my one word to describe Adrian is faithful. Very faithful. She's faithful to her YouTube. She's faithful to. I'm friends. trying to be. She's a faithful sister. Like anything we need, she's you know ready and able. We can, I can always call on her. She's like the faithful one. And then my one word to describe Andrea is compassionate. She's very compassionate. She has a heart for the people. Um, she's very giving and understanding you can talk to her about anything she can be basically like a mediator between us at times if we need her to be oh yeah um so she's very understanding she's you know all of the above compassionate okay this is gonna be funny what is your favorite inside joke for each other <laughs> i would say it would be <laughs> every time somebody like <laughs> growing up we used to always oh my have this God. little like, like, I gotcha, like, yep. she told you. <laughs> that was all little inside joke. Like, if somebody got red or somebody yes. like did something wrong, yes. like, oh, mama told you to do this, or oh, she told you, it was. <laughs> mama could not and it was it. like our little inside joke. My mama hated when we say that. She used to get mad at us, but yeah, that's all we do. All I, say yeah, that was our mm -hmm. inside joke. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, favorite season. My favorite season would be maybe spring. Um, yeah, I would say spring because winter. We don't really have a winter here in Louisiana. It's like it's in January. January. hot. February. Um, yeah, it's our winter, so we really don't experience the snow and all that. Ours is very humid, so I would say spring. That's mine. Mine is uh, spring too. I thought y'all kissed this thing. Sisters. I love it. Uh, spring, it's like not too hot. Well, it is, it'd be kind of hot too, but not. Too, but then there's like a breeze in the springtime too. And you can wear shorts, you can wear pants. I love wearing yoga pants, so I can. I love springtime. I can just relax and be comfortable. Yeah. Mine would be winter. I like the cold. I love fur. I love the snow. Yes, I does. love. Just the season of Christmas because it's about giving and family. It's just very, I just love it. I love it's about season. Jesus. It's about Jesus, but the season, okay? <laughs> and I, the season. <laughs> Jesus and boots. <laughs> season. <laughs> season and boots and fur. So, yeah, I just love the cold. It's just uh, a nice, uh, just a very nice time. I just 
love wintertime. Mm -hmm. Heels or flats? I say heels. I say heels. You say I'll heels? Wear, I'll wear heels pretty much every day at work, so uh -oh. I say heels. I say heels. You wear heels every day to work? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, okay then. Business. Yeah, business is hard. <sighs> I work downtown, but I don't wear those every day. She's too much. Walk a lot. She's a flat girl. I don't wear the flats. Um, yeah, I always have flats on downtown, downtown Houston. Cause we're like, and I mean, there's tunnels. We walk everywhere downtown, so I, flats for me. But I like yeah. dressing it up. I like wearing heels too. The husband likes the heels. The okay. <laughs> husband likes the heels. Stilettos in particular. But they're so uncomfortable. So like that's something like a you know every now and then. Yeah. Special occasions. Yeah. Okay. All right. Heels or flats? <clears throat> um, heels. Mm -hmm. Heels. Mm -hmm. Heels. Okay. Smiley. Yeah. Even her flip flops are heels, okay? Yeah. <laughs> she has like, <laughs> Every flip flop she owns has literally that. has like a five inch heel on it. She <laughs> wore my my flip flops last night. Or she my ain't got them in here, but I was going up. Blackberry or iPhone? Durr. iPhone. She has hers too, but she doesn't have it with her. iPhone. Team iPhone every day, all day, er day. Yeah. All right, so the next question is favorite movie. Yay! You excited about that question? Yes. What's, what's your favorite movie, Andrea? I think she's so excited about it. Um, I know your favorite movie is. Let's see. With the. You better get it right too. If I uh, hold on, let's see. It's with the black men. Yes. Tyrese. No. The best man. Tyrese is not in the best man. Oh, I'm sorry. How <laughs> do you put those two together? Oh my god. I do like Tyrese. I really, really but do. But anyway, it's the best man. It is her. the best man. Yes, yeah, it is the best. For sure. Yeah. But actually, my favorite is uh, Liar Liar, Jim Carrey. Like, Jim I Carrey. love Jim Carrey. He is so funny. Jim Carrey is funny. I love Liar Liar. Liar is my favorite. If you were in your house and it was burning down, what would you take? My family, of course. Durr. My family would be first. <laughs> okay, that's but materialistic thing. Yeah, let's say materialistic. This on my phone. Mm -hmm. For me. Yeah, everything else I can cop up again, but you can what? What that mean? Cop she up. can get a good name. Oh, get <laughs> okay. I thought you meant like cop, like copy off of me what I just said. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, it'll just be family and phone probably. Man, I'm gonna keep the real. I pack this pillow up and have it to stop with the girl. <laughs> yes! The no, pillow! You still have that pillow. Oh my Everywhere. god. Everywhere! So I'm gonna just keep it real. Me and my pillow. <laughs> Forget the family <laughs> sticking that pillow, okay? Forget the husband and the children. Okay. Oh, yeah. Have you named your pillow yet? No. You should. You need yes. to all these years. All these years. How many years? I don't know. It's just ever since, you know, it's just that transitional object you have when you were a kid. It's just. I keep it everywhere though. So and she rubs on it like it's a like it's a, a kitten. <laughs> I like the pillow. I like soft touches. Oh, okay. The pillow. Soft and she rubs it so softly. <laughs> So this completes this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed me and my little sisters. My little sister, my big, big sister. sister. I love them to death. So that's it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching. Mwah. Bye. Bye. Welcome back. So it's Adrian. So today's we uh, today's we uh let me do it over. Okay, wait, one, two, <laughs> I don't know how it is. One, two, three. Hey guys. No. And let's see. I am a nurse. I work in a medical occupation, therefore I wear scrubs on a daily basis. This she is on uh, business attire, so she takes the longest to get dressed, okay? Talking like that. Okay, I'm the best you <laughs> Just be yourself. Just be yourself. Andrea, I would say yours is a. You guys have questions about this? Well, who's supposed to say? <laughs> Very pivotal point in our lives. We look forward to it every year. Can't get enough of your love, baby. Wait. <laughs> what, what, does, what does pivotal mean? The highest point. Oh, like no, comments? actually, pivot is oh. to turn. No, it could also be a pivotal moment as in, yeah, to, to turn means to another change, another level. Oh, pinnacle. Pinnacle? 
That's some big words. I don't know all that. Okay. Okay, I would say winter. I'm opposite. I love a uh, uh, winter time. That's when I got married. So I just love winter. Even if though we live in Louisiana, we always do travel to Colorado to the snow. So. Why are you talking like that? Tara, that is not true. Why are you talking no, like that? No, it's not. Be real. I didn't tell you that. Tara, this is Phoebe. Not the Phoebe. No, it's not. She's like that camera, girl. You jiggle at one. Girl, come sit down and take this thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you want to start from the beginning?